All these. Which one is it you get? I don't know. Morning all, welcome to the start of this week's vlog. Now if you didn't catch the end of last week's vlog, I kind of said that this week I'm going to Nottingham. Well, this weekend I'm going to Nottingham. Um, but we're going in the afternoon, so I thought I'm going to nip out before and just just do some stuff. got some stuff that I want to give me Nan, and I want to go shopping for some stuff as well. But I came in to the living room to look if we had any post, and I noticed that a, a, like a little package had come. Now I wasn't really expecting anything, but... The other day, I saw that um, they were giving out some freebies through Facebook. So I had a look, and I actually managed to bag myself a sample of this, which is Polo Ralph Lauren Red Eau de Perfume. Um, I mean, it's 1.2 milliliters, so it's not even that big, and it's actually tiny. But if I just show you it, this is what arrived. It's, it's tiny. It's got a tiny little bit of this perfuming which isn't bad but let's give it a test that smell out so maybe I need to wait for it to actually like go in don't really smell it though I mean when you first spray it on it smells like some proper strong vodka but it just smells like regular stuff it smells a bit like diesel not diesel, petrol diesel, I mean the actual brand of perfume, stroke aftershave diesel. So, yeah, that's what I've got, and let's see what the day brings. So I've just got in the car, and given it a bit of time to soak in that aftershave, and it smells alright, you know. It smells very... Well, I've had aftershave in the past, and you spray it and it lasts like two minutes and the smell just evaporates into air, but this kind of lingers. But not like a bad lingering smell. It's like a nice masculine smell. Like the smell that you want to smell of when you want to smell good. Fanta de McFlurry. So, we've got it. Now, for some reason, in this McDonald's, which is in Ollerton, they, um, New Allerton, sorry. They don't have the big version of the new Cadbury's Caramel one, so I've had to go in for a smaller one. Um, friggin' Worksop Mackey's was mental. New Allerton at Mackey's is just as mental. Couldn't get around, nearly sideswiped a guy. But, oh, it's beautiful. It's like, 30 odd degrees in my car. I'll wait to David's thought, you know what, stop off at Mackey's and enjoy myself a summer treat. And so, made it to his house. Never showed you, but we've got tent in back again. His garden's fairly big, so the tent might actually fit. I would give you a tour, but there's not much room down there. <laughs> so we've got some doggy business. There's a pothole there, so don't fall down that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm complaining about this campsite, it's horrible. Got a, you see her? And I've got a rose bush. That's great. <laughs> and he's still there pumping up. I was trying to do my three. Just 
It looks solid. I don't know. That one was orange. What does it smell like? It smells like some sort. That's orange. That's like orange. Oh no. It smells like skin. It smells like hand sanitizer you have to put on. It smells like sick. Oh wait, that's me inside. That's skittle. That's definitely skittle. Smell that. Skittle. That is no shadow on that. Oh, it's on my nose. That's the back. That's why I got coffee. I've also got Corona. That's weird that you said that. I'm going to ask the Corona. Oh, yeah, that could be. Yeah, that could be like caramel. Should we, should we get in the queue? Should we get in the cafe? Should we get in the cafe or the queue? I think you can't get in the cafe. How, how's that woman in the, in the bridal costume beat us when she was there flirting with Peace? <laughs> it's terrible. A different bride. I was saying I went down to Bristol once and there were six one empires in one night. Oh, Glug glugs, hamburger no bun, <laughs> stuff in there. Some tea bag, not too shabby. Yeah, so there we go, guys. I'm back at last. So I went for a spoon's breakfast this morning, um, which was which was pretty nice, to say the least. And um, yeah, it brings us to the end of this week's vlog. So I hope you've all enjoyed it. It was quite a nice weekend in uh, Nottingham. I had a good catch up. Um, I had a very nice cocktail, good old Sex on the Beach, which was very, very nice in uh, Cookie Lounge. Uh, we were also celebrating Corey's birthday, so I hope you had a good birthday, Corey. And um, yeah, in other news, next week it's Kaylee's birthday, so expect there to be lots of birthday banter and all that. And um, yeah, bid you all farewell. See you all next week for another fantastic vlog. Bye-bye.